Yeah, it's Nest Base Auto, and I'm back with another short video, a helping hand. Like I told you, I do a lot of things, you know, my videos might, might step into me working on something. You know, it can be a lot of things, but I'm a car review, but I love working on cars too. I love showing a few little things. Now, I got this 2009 Avalanche that I just got. I always wanted one of these vehicles. I don't know why I always, I always wanted one. And I know I was gonna end up with one. I'm, and it got to where I want two of them now. So I'm looking for one, another one. But yeah, it need brakes on it. I just got it need front brakes on it. Here it go right here though, y'all. Gang, 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 next base gang. It's right there. 2009 Avalanche. I'm fucking clean too. I ain't fucking with no ugly shit. My shit clean. I don't mess with no ugly shit. Five three motor. Five three motor. Five three motor. Five three motor. It's baby. It's baby. It's baby. It's baby. It's baby. It's baby. It's baby, it's baby. It's baby, it's baby. Yeah, we'll be getting back shortly with that. That's a stay tuned real shortly because uh, that's coming up. Boy, that car is coming up. It's a beast. That's my baby. The Black Ghost. Okay, now, uh, this here is what I'm doing now, y'all. Okay, we're going to sit this camera down. And we're going to get to fixing Break shoes, break pads, brother. Not shoes, but pads. Sorry about that. Okay. Okay, now. I'm gonna swing on this. His back a little bit there. Pretty neat and shit. I don't really need her, but I don't want to see. Yeah, well. It shows what it shows. Go back farther, it'll be better. Okay. There we go, y'all. Start by right here. Get y'all some kind of content. Shit. Yeah, we started off by this here, I guess. Get your craftsman box. Everybody wants some of those. You uh Milwaukee. <laughs> Anybody I gotta go back to the power store because 
put uh, brakes on one of these because this is my first time. I don't even know. I always wanted one of these though and I found that one. An avalanche. An avalanche. An avalanche in love. I'm kind of gentle a little bit. I let people use stuff. So far, I don't know. I'm gonna check to see if he put my stuff back because it looks like I'm shot somewhere down the line with one of these. Yeah. It looks like I'm shot at right there. Like something missing here, gang. Somebody then got over on me, gang, 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 gang. You go, you get you one of these bad babies, man. Let's call it uh, impact. Let's call it impact. Stuff gets rough for me. What the hell is going on? Screwdriver, dude. Hi. Fill up. Oh, flathead. Hi. Yeah, this ratchet is loose. And it still got the uh, plastic stuff stuck in it. So I can't get it on my impact. It's the first time I uh, used this thing. It had got rusty gang on me. Out there to my people. Thank you. Alright. I gotta get something out to my people, man. I gotta get something out for y'all to see how to do this kind of stuff. See, I got a big C clamp, man, too, y'all, gang. Okay? Try this joint on three. They really don't play. You gotta work. Where am I getting no bolts out? I do want to act stupid. I got a button up under here, which is right here. I hit that baby on uh, on that force. It's coming off. I don't care what you done. Coming off. Yes. It's coming off. <laughs> I ain't gonna holler like that on the video, y'all. <laughs> showing y'all but uh yes first thing you do you gotta have the tools to do the job with 
Doc two, you ain't nothing. Hey, what you doing in your no bread? Shape. Huh? What you doing in your bread? Uh, just a little mustard and a little mayonnaise on there. All right. Just a little bit. Doc two merch. What's the new line right now? That's that I'm talking about. Okay, this is the wheel off, y'all. We got the wheel off. And what we're going to do with this wheel to protect you, you're going to get up and you're going to chase it. Now, don't chase it like that. <laughs> but yeah, you're going to move stuff over like this here. It's in your way. Matter of fact, that dirt is in your way. So you want to just kind of lay this tie down, you know? It's actually for protection. You want to kind of put it under the car a little bit, like that. Then you want to take your time and slide over here near the car. And like, damn, them brakes look good over here. Somebody put some bricks over there or something. Or something. Or something. But. Hey, uh, bring some DW40. Okay. We also want to, uh, you know, it's an easy way to get this caliber back, y'all, gang. Well, hold on just a second. I'm back. Uh, right, hold up, gang, gang. Let me uh, let me go on here and turn this wheel. All right, I know this is gonna be a kind of long little video, but it's worth it. Oh, excuse me. Hold on a second, y'all. Okay, that's the wheel turn. Okay, now she'll, she'll use a hammer, screwdriver. You go like in between this, it's like in between the brake and the, uh, and the rotor. You kind of slight tap. Slight tap in between there like that. Get the get the caliber to go back some. Not, not going in between there. You gotta do it that hard, you know, just a little. You knock on through there, then you push your uh you push your caliber back, you know, that way you ain't gotta go through so much so much with the C clamp, you know. You just squeeze it on in there like that. And eventually it'll, it'll uh, tingle it on back out with your hammer. So you got you a nice little, nice little, uh, good hammer like this one here. Uh, you push that back like that. And you, and you do that. Pull it back on the back like that. Like that, you know you're knocking it back. Knocking on it in some more. Knock 
knock it over. Not some more like that, you pull. Put a cowboy on the back. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about. Shit. Y'all wait over here. Ah, come on over here. See, as you putting that screwdriver in that piece right there, right in there, and as you knock it in, you taking that caliber, you pulling your screwdriver over, you pulling the caliber back, pushing your caliber back. You got a, a two-pin caliber, what you call right here, a two-pin brake caliber, what you call. You pull that on back away from it, and then you sit your uh, camera back down like this so right? y'all can see what I'm doing. Once I do that there, I pull that back right there. Hey, bring me the DW40. Push that back like that there. Like that there. Yeah, it's like that there. I don't understand why that other, this brake here look good over here. But I'm getting squeaking over on the other side. So it's got something to do with that over there. So now, if I can get, uh, now we need like a 13. And you already got the key. You already got the, um, what you call it? The what? The more control is yeah. on, on the table. Oh, okay. More control to the car is on the table. Bring me DW40. All right. Hurry up. No, that is not a 13. Uh, it's sure not a 14 either. What the hell? See, this is my first time doing it. It's a four, and it's not a 15 because that's a kind of big old boat there, and it's not a 16. It's bigger than a 16, boy. This baby here got some big stuff on it. What is that? Oh, Lord, it's bigger than that. It's bigger than a 17. Oh, Lord, it's bigger than an 18, huh? So I'm going to have to come with one of my big boys for this, huh? Oh, what is this? What is that? Hey, go bring me that big, uh, uh I'm gonna just use my drill, let me see. Yeah. It's a 21. Yeah, no, it's smaller than a 21. Smaller than a 21. Oh, smaller than a 21. What's that? 92, oh, what is it now? Come on, now. What's going on? You know, I got the ratchet for this. Something right about that now. What's this? A 19. That calls for a 19. Hey, boy. Bring my big ratchet. It calls for a 19, gang. It calls for a 19, gang, gang. Okay, now you take the DW40, right? It's a boat on each side. There's one here at the top, one down here at the bottom. So ain't got no art on it, so you agree it with the DW40. Right there. Finally got my gang gang of video, man. Putting brakes on. Get <laughs> that uh over there. Little nigga, little dude, uh, Rosie. Nah. That's his mama? Nah, that's his mama. That's his mama gone. Oh, that's where they at, then. They had the, um... You know. Hey man, go bring me that big ratchet. You know it's out, the, um, out that bag, plastic bag by the uh dryer. It's that blue handle ratchet. It got two sides to it. All right. Big, kind of big. Hurry up, man. I'm trying, I'm doing a video. Can't be slowing around now. I got these people waiting on me. Doing them trying to fix their car. I hope so. I hope somebody go in there and subscribe to my channel and like. Like all my videos, man. You know, I go to car review. I got that black ghost going on. Stay tuned for that. Y'all been staying tuned. I ain't had no, I ain't, I ain't been having no kind of uh, persistence going on because they ain't been going so messed up for me. Like I'm saying, I ain't quitting. I'm not a quitter. I'm a leader, not a follower. So that's why I'm leading y'all on right now with this video. If you got a, uh, 2009 uh, Chevrolet Avalanche 4x4 GMC. This is how to do the front brakes on it. Brake pads, rather. Front brake pads on it. So that's what I'm schooling y'all with, so that's what I'm doing. Hurry up, man. It's right there in the plastic bag. Blue handle. Oh, man. Yeah, that's it, buddy. Hurry up. This is consistent on your butt, boy.
Let's play the game. Right on, baby. We getting it. Let me see. Okay, y'all. We back. Let's see what we got here, babe. Okay, we got this old. See, this is a two side ratchet. This is a good ratchet, though. I ain't lying. It's good. It's two sides for the uh, three eighths and for a uh, half inch. But you can use it on anything, on any, you know, three eighths or any uh, half inch. Yeah. You got to put that boy on here now. Oh, he's messing with me with this right here. Won't let me get it. Oh, okay, then y'all want to act like that. Put Muscle Man on that end. Maybe I'll get you right here. I know. You be done quick. See why I didn't use that at first, gang gang. <laughs> because it, 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 it stops a whole lot of problems. <laughs> believe me. Believe in me, baby. I wouldn't even leave this thing outside if I go to the hardware store anywhere. You get anything because you come back, it might be gone. You be looking stupid. Like my 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 thing is gone. Looking stupid in the mouth. He'd be like somebody be saying the thrill is gone, singing that song to you. The thrill is gone from you, oh baby. Man, I don't see how this straight breaks you so good. Yeah, that's crazy. Well, good, good tomorrow. I'm going bougie, I'm pushing my foot back. <laughs>
Yeah, I would need that for a minute. Yeah, y'all will. Did I stop? Or did I keep going? <laughs> yeah, but these brakes shoes here, y'all. Let me show y'all, baby. Okay, now I'm back with the video. Um, I just went and purchased the brakes. Well, when you got the brakes, do a last. Okay, now we back. Go to brake shoes again. Bam, 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 bam. Now I'm finna put them on. <laughs> Go to the side over here. You know, as we say, that's the caliber there. The caliber right there. And the uh, uh, the rotor. And the brakes. So now I sit the phone down here. And we we'll start on um, putting them on. Okay, put them right there. Okay, remember the pin right here. The pin always go to the bottom. The pin right there. Go to the bottom. You slide them in like this here. Slide the rascal in like that. Slide in right there. Take the front one. Yeah. Slide that rascal in right there. Yeah. There you go. Front, back. Take your caliber. I hear it, Calvin. Slide it on. Bam. You go forward like that, then slide in. Let me see it like that. There you push the little rubber. You got a little rubber there. Slide it in like this. Right there. Take your screws. This would be a 19. Put that in there. Pull the caliber up a little bit. Get the screw to start like that. Bam. Got one started. Bam. Right there. Man. Start the other yeah. one right here. Hey. Get out of my video. Who was that? You that there. You come with a 19 here. Bam. You got one of these babies to be the best one to have. One of these, like I say, Milwaukee. Phew. Which is a fuse. Fuse system. Make sure you got the right way. Turn that mug on too because you don't want to go too hard because it will tighten up some stuff. Too much. Going down, man. We even know it. You know it ain't going nowhere. Oh, you got that? Everything's legit. You know, you have to put grease on your slides, you know. Uh, on your slides will be grease. On your slides uh, will be, uh, let me see. Where do I have that stuff at? These are bolts for the wheels. Uh, okay. We'll get you some of this right here. Brake lubricate. You know what I'm saying? That will go on your slides, which is your slides will be right. The slide is right here. You will put it in there. All right, in the slides right there. It's the caliber, see? In the slides. But you had a break off, you just put it in there, and then the break goes in between there. That keeps your brakes from squeaking. So. Now. Uh, that uh you go in here and you turn your wheel straight Turn your wheel straight. Hey, hi, video. <laughs> you get your um, get your wheel out, and you will roll it over here gently. Move your tools out the way. 
never jack your car up too far that way you ain't got too much to put on. Or get the wheel on you, grab it like that. You pick it up. Pick it up. Let me go ahead and let one jack down because it's finished over there. If you got two jacks, you cool. Video's still going, which is good. people how to deal with this but also i want you to invest in you one of them one of them milwaukee's boy what you want to need you in there well you have so many problems when you also when you have a flat or something you got that milwaukee you gonna get everything together milwaukee gonna get you where you need to be Don't get uh don't get them wheels off. Especially on these trucks or these wheels. Gotta make sure your stuff tight. Yeah, once he does it. Say you got a button on it, you go click that baby over here, boy. Click it on two, and you go to two, then try it on two. Down, go crossways, side, over, over, up. Then you go to three. God darn it, you go to three, then go up. Shit tight for going the speed you want to go. So I do it again to make sure that I'm safe. God damn it! Make sure your family. Your wrenches up like this here, and then you take the one of them and you check it. Uh, I think that might be the same size as the thing, huh? You can tighten it up with that. You just slap the cap on like that. The cap goes on, and you just turn them with your hand. 
got a little click to them, and you'll hear it, you'll feel it. A little click that holds them on tight. There you go. I can click to it. You'll know when it click, click, it's tight. You ain't gotta worry about losing your cap. It's gonna click in, it's gonna click. Now, let's set there, get the tools out the way. And then, I always have a little problem. I don't see why I didn't let that jack him have a problem with this jack here getting down the gun. Oh, it went easy. Put that back in there. That. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, baby. It's Ness Base Auto. Showing you things, like I said, you can find a lot of things going on my channel. It ain't just, uh, you know, going to car show. I'm about showing you how to work on your own stuff, too. You know, that's what I'm about. So if you ever, if you ever, 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 ever get an avalanche, 2009, 2009, very beautiful truck now, I'll tell you that. I'm gonna throw something on that baby though. And Space Auto up to something with this too, so stay tuned. Stay tuned for everything that I do. Make sure you go share, like, subscribe, turn on all notifications, and join the Net Space game so we can get it. Hear what I said? Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe. Like. Thumbs up them videos, man. Like this video that we just done on this truck. I showed it to you the best ability the way it could be. I showed you by hand and showed you pointed out certain things that you need to know. So that's what you do. Take notes to it, you know. You uh, pull it up and uh, look it up. When you get it, make sure you hit that button. Subscribe to my channel. And there's more. Stay tuned for the Black Ghost, man. That's some horsepower, man. I built that car and had that car for years, man. I built it. So I want y'all to, uh, you know, subscribe to the channel when you go to it, you know, and also watch it. Give me some watch time on that stuff. Me chilling at home instead of watching something else, watching that space game. I mean, watching that space auto. You're in that space game, but like I said, I'm, I'm I'm there to give you things and and do things. That's what my channel is about, and that's why I need you, baby. Need y'all, man, to support my channel. You know, I ain't get no support on my channel. I had a bunch of stuff going on with me, bad. Then y'all know how my life went, and if you watch my channel, you know what I've been through. So support me, man. You know, because I'm going to support y'all. I need to support, man. I'm doing all this stuff for nothing. What? Help me. <laughs> Join, man. Subscribe to my channel. Like I said, it's a YouTube thing, man. And it, and it helps, man. Like when you need, like, like if you need to know how to put brakes on this thing, you go on there, I'm going to come up. You know, when I come up, I'm going to show you the best way I can, the best ability how to work on this on this truck. It'll be more stuff that I'm going to do to it and other stuff too, other vehicles that I'll be showing up on because that's what I do. I fix stuff, man. I, this is my job. I work on stuff, man. Here to show y'all what I do. That's what I do, so support me with it. Don't hide on me and stuff. Support my channel. Help me out. Hit that button. That helps me out right there when you subscribe to my channel. And turn on your notifications so you know when I'm doing something. You know, it could be, you know, this this uh the car show stuff. You know, that's that's what I'm going to be a relevant on because I'm a car reviewer and I love it. You know, I love working on cars too. So 
the little stuff that y'all need to know that you can do for yourself instead of going, you know, spending money, you know, and, and you can buy the little stuff and save something in your pocket. You know, go to my channel and learn how to do something, you know. Go to the channel, you know, it's going to come up anyway to show you, so. Because I'm a YouTuber, so. First thing you look for, uh, how to uh, put a, uh, uh, some brakes on a uh, 2009 uh, 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 Avalanche, Chevrolet Avalanche GMC. I'm going to come up, and then I'll show you how to do it. So now you know this is over and what they said and done. Yeah, this is after I put the brakes on the Avalanche. I'm finna show y'all a little quick video when I'm coming around the corner. I got my holder to hold my camera for me. Okay, he gonna be standing out when I come around that video. The camera's recording now, so he gonna record me going and leaving and coming around the block, coming around that block. So hey, here we go. Keep that camera to me and let's go. All right. Be right back. Turn it this oh. way, yeah. That's the way it was going. All right. The green lights looking good. That's Grace Gang, y'all. <laughs> Dead boy. <laughs> That's very gang, y'all. We getting it. Hello, y'all. You see me coming? <laughs> Dang. This thing fast as heck. <laughs> That's what he's getting. Y'all like, subscribe, turn the post notifications on. And we getting it, baby. Yeah, now we finna see how this look right quick. All right, man, this Nets Base Auto, man. I'm checking out this video. See the brakes on there now? So I'm checking out this video. I'm out. Nets Base, man. Word up.